I'm Andy McIndoo. I'm Managing Director of Hillier Nurseries and Garden Centres. I've been with Hillier since 1978 and it's interesting how much the industry has changed since that time. Do you know, when I first started here, out-of-town retailing didn't really exist and garden centres were only just getting going. Believe it or not, we didn't even open in those days on Sundays. When I started, we had one garden centre which was in Winchester and that had a turnover then of about 150,000. Today, we have 13 garden centres and we built the group gradually over the years. As things have developed, of course, our requirements in terms of management and coordination of the group have increased. And that's led really to the introduction of our retail management system just in the past few years. Hillier has an international reputation in the world of horticulture. We're known primarily as growers of the world's widest range of trees and shrubs. Next year, Hillier will be 150 years old as a company. And really what put Hillier on the map was the late Sir Harold Hillier's passion for plants and the way that he collected and established the world-renowned Hillier Arboretum, which is today known as the Sir Harold Hillier Gardens. Today, I suppose, Hillier is best known um, for its record at Chelsea Flower Show. Last year was our 68th consecutive gold medal, which got us into the Guinness Book of World Records a few years ago. Um, this year, we're hoping that will make it 69th in our 150th year. Growing period of the Hillier Garden Centre group, of course, we didn't have an EPOS system or any type of retail management. So I suppose our buying decisions were very much based on instinct, observation, and also to a certain extent, a little bit of luck and judgment. Hillier is essentially a family business and all of the people who work in it really are part of that family. So are our suppliers and actually providers of all of our services. We've always valued long-term relationships and very close working relationships and we certainly wanted that to be the foundation of our decision in choosing Corby and Fellers as the provider of our system. We want people that we can work with in the long term to really get the best out of um, the people that we're choosing. I engaged an expert, uh, Martin White of Thinkers, to actually look at all of the systems out there, to look at our needs and what we wanted to actually achieve. And we went through a really rigorous selection process to actually find and finally choose Corby and Fellers to actually provide the system for us. I think all parties were very structured in their approach to the implementation of the process. Certainly thinkers encouraged us to actually look at every step along the way. And also we used a system of training the trainer to make sure that the actual implementation was understood by all parties. You know, it's always the question is that, is there resistance to change and of course the implementation of a system like this? And I think what we wanted to make sure that everybody was on board from the outset. And I have to say, I don't think we came across any resistance whatsoever. Just enthusiasm from everybody to actually embrace the system and make it work. And I think along the way, Corby and Fellas helped us right the way down the line. And we're always there to sort out any of the issues that we came across. I think everybody in retail is very aware of the developments that are going on out there in terms of e-commerce. I think it's easy to get carried away and actually to move too fast down some of these channels because the foundation of our business is very much retail orientated and we have to look after our retail outlets. But we never lose sight of the developments that are potentially there. And certainly that is something that I feel we are now very well equipped to move forward on as retail progresses in the future. 
I'd have no hesitation in recommending Corby and Fellers as providers of a retail management system and to support any business moving forward, whether online or through retail outlets.